So as I'm uh, continuing to prepare for my trip to India, of course, I'm doing things like uh, applying for a visa and getting my flight reservations put together and checking out hotels, blah, blah, blah. But I'm also spending time uh, absorbing some of the Indian culture. And uh, this is something I showed before. This is uh, a book of poems by the Indian poet Rabindranath Tagore. And uh, Tagore won the Nobel Prize for Literature back in 1913. And his most famous collection of poetry is Kitanjali. It was published in English in 1911, so 100 years ago. The poems are fantastic. I've had this book for a while. Uh, and every time I reread it, I get sort of another layer of complexity out of the poetry. Uh, and they're just beautiful. The poems are about uh, prayer and devotion. They're about uh, love and passion. And they're about the mystery and wonder of life. So I'm rereading the poems uh, to get ready for my trip. And I thought I'd share one of them with you here today. There's no title to these poems. They're simply numbered. And this one is number 69. The same stream of life that runs through my veins night and day runs through the world and dances in rhythmic measures. It is the same life that shoots in joy through the dust of the earth in numberless blades of grass and breaks into tumultuous waves of leaves and flowers. It is the same life that is rocked in the ocean cradle of birth and death in ebb and in flow. I feel my limbs are made glorious by the touch of this world of life, and my pride is from the life throb of ages dancing in my blood this moment. Wow, if I could wake up every day and be that motivated just to be alive. Real beautiful stuff. Um, I urge you to get outside the box a little bit and, and read things that might surprise you. This one's a good one for me.